Yeah, so I'm going to waste all the time. Alright, guys, so uh, not long to go till we are heading to the plane. I'm actually pretty nervous, but um, one thing I did learn is that fear can take over, but the mind is more powerful. If you can tell yourself you can do it, you can do it. I am a bit nervous, but um, at the same time, uh, I did say that I'm here to do it. It's going to be a great time. It's going to be a huge highlight for me this year. And it's just going out of the ordinary and stepping out of the comfort zone, right? Like what everyone says. But uh, I'm ready. My uh, stills. I can take, I can rip photos off this, right? This is just a backup, okay? Yep. But this is a video as well. So, and if this fails, then this is obviously shooting in 4K and can and overtake that. Uh, awesome. Take photos with my tongue, and I can I keep you in the frame by using this as a ring sight. So it's like a crosshair of a rifle, basically. And uh, if I've got you in that, that means you're in all of this. All right, guys, so we just get up and uh, couple minutes I guess we're about to head up get ready uh, we're about to do this 15,000 feet top of tandem skydive and uh, we're excited let's do this we'll see you once we land we'll see you guys very soon Wow, that was one of a hell of an experience right here and I never thought that would be a crazy thing but man, the rush, the adrenaline that kicks in, the moment you walk into the plane, sit down, cars on, 15,000 feet and then we got back down, the moment the first couple of people going down, hear them screaming down, was one of the it was an indescribable feeling and uh, honestly when we jumped out of the plane, I was the last one. Um, man, ten, ten, uh, Topo Tandem Skydive is one of the best places because one, that's they just really take your time um, get, to get to know you, make you feel comfortable. And the best experience was the moment, the first couple of seconds when you go down, that moment was probably one of the most yeah. unforgettable <laughs> moments oh I'd say. <laughs> and Karina. And it all so fast. It was oh. crazy. But the view was amazing. Oh, yeah. so good. Yeah, that's we right. We were allowed to control the paraglide. So. Yeah. Really yeah, so you know what the good thing about this is uh, we feel so awake. Before when we came here, I think we only had <laughs> three hours Slept sleep. Two, hours, two yeah. to three hours sleep, and now you're just ready for the day again. Uh, made the landing a bit difficult, but that felt so good. And I but felt you great. could stand and walk. And I yeah. I did a bump landing. <laughs> and I did a running landing, so that was really, really cool. Anyway, we are about to get our footage. 
Anything else you'd like to say, baby? About uh, the experience? Just, yeah, I can recommend it to everyone. Right. No matter how, yeah. yeah, if you are afraid of heights. Our next campground is Lake Topo Holiday Resort. Happy holidays! We will show you later how nice feature this campground is. Three, two, one, and action! Hey guys, so we are back for today. We have knocked today's skydive out of the bucket list. And uh, what do you think? It was. Yeah, oh, man. Epic. Oh my gosh. But anyway, we've knocked up today and we just relaxed, checked in here in Lake Taupo Holiday Resort. As you can see, this is one of the nicest places for, uh, I guess, a holiday resort, should I say? Because this is the only New Zealand um, swim up bar, as you can see over there. And look how epic that is. So and you, you can watch a movie over there. And a, Currently, currently it's a sport because yeah. we just missed the movie. This is our fourth day on a New Zealand trip since we launched uh, our sweet hideout four days ago. And uh, so far, journey is so good. And uh, what else? What do you think of our journey so far? And uh, what are you looking for? Uh, yeah, our travel so far. It started already amazing. And every day we did like a very cool activity and we saw already amazing places. Can only get more better, and yeah, I'm really looking forward to the next days, and especially the South Island. Yes, yeah, the South I'm Island. So excited. so excited! So we are just taking some time. We've been moving so fast in the last couple of days, but we enjoy every minute of it. Some days, some nights, we don't get as much sleep, but uh, we survive. We make it happen. Yeah. Yeah. And my biggest highlight so far for the trip. Is actually, I can't say all of it, of course, because all of it to me is such a huge experience. But nothing is possible. The biggest highlight is actually to make this all happen. Is actually, yeah. uh, I mean, what do I say? A sweet highlight is probably one of the most sweetest things that's ever happened. And uh, I am so looking forward to seeing this brand grow and uh, what 2020 has in store for us. Um, we got a lot of more travels happening soon, but for now, enjoy New Zealand trip, enjoy our vlogs, and uh, I'm sure you'll be hearing more about Karina's story because she is turning into a vlogger as well, and her editing skills are getting crazy as well. Um, who knows? Anyway, we're gonna cut that short. This is the end of our vlog, day four, and day five tomorrow. It's gonna be epic. <laughs> And uh, we got some people saying hello, so uh, maybe we should say hello. You guys want to say hi? Yeah! Hi! Oh, shit. Kia ora! Where are you guys from? Tauranga! Tauranga! Oh, yeah, we're from uh, Papamoa. Oh, yeah. Epica. Oh, anyway. Yeah, yeah, can you guys say our sweet hideout? Because that's our, that's our YouTube uh, or a Instagram. Sweet hideout? Yeah, that's How our. many followers do you have? We just, we just started, but can you guys say it at the same time? It'll be so cool. Pretty three, two, one. Sweet hideout! Woo! Our new fans.